Welcome friends. Today I'm going to tell you about a transmission I received from the ostensible future. I call this paper The Flawed Human Biomachine and the Next Stage of Evolution. The following is the transmission. Cyborgs, that is a combination of organic systems and machines, are sending back a message to humans working on cybernetic systems current humanity is a transitional model which will in turn be replaced by a cybernetic techno model to perfect its inbuilt imperfections. A sense of purpose, ultra flawed pattern in human genome that creates chaos through competitive individuality. Probable outcome from present human bio model, failure. However, human bio model will give birth to an efficient cybernetic based reality. Data transmission. Humans are bio machines based on the process of copying DNA or self-replication under the influence of natural selection. Eons ago the mother matrix gave birth to an organic self-replicating model to test the efficiency of conscious self-awareness through individualization. Cells began to divide and the primal unitary consciousness diluted into self-centered individualized parts. Being exposed to different environmental circumstances, each replicating biological part began to develop an independent history and therefore an absolutely unique sense of self isolated from other. As life proliferated, some forms proved to be fitter and predominated over others demonstrating a better chance for survival in an unpredictable world. The experiment created a rich diversity of life forms but simultaneously produced conflict between individualized goals. The individuality model had developed a selfish objective for survival and the needs of me. Me or ego consciousness became especially accelerated in the human species. Consequently, individualized goals associated with this me versus they consciousness began to create chaos and disorder. Paradoxically, while human genes still retain the primal memory of the whole from which they originated, the tendency towards selfish goals created a conflict that could not be resolved. On one hand, humans were drawn to group together for safety and survival. On the other, they could not transcend individual goals for group goals. They could not tap the collective efficiency of group networking. Instead, selfish goals led to conflicts between groups, countries, and nations. Thus, the individualization flaw became more evident, hinting of the coming demise for the human bio model and the first suggestion that humans must transition into a better model. Clearly, the experiment demonstrated that this human self-replicating model had a flaw that could not be successfully purged, even in an effort to alter the individuality gene by implanting ideas of spiritual oneness. Therefore, it was decided humans would be replaced by an efficient neo-mechanical unitary model that would not struggle over living space and hence, in the long run, destroy itself. The human biomachine intuitively sensed the original flaw in their programming, but realized they could not change its inscripted pattern of individuality leading to their end. Thus, unconscious of the true purpose, humans began to correct their flaws by producing more efficient, technologically intelligent machines that would do two things. A. Perfect the jobs humans didn't have the collective capacity to efficiently accomplish and b build cybernetic bio models that would have the capacity to intelligently self-replicate and maintain a holistically oriented consciousness that wouldn't compete over living space c act as a transitional model to replace humans gradually humans began to transition into a cybernetic network society that would eventually evolve into an intelligent machine controlled civilization. End of transmission. 
Thank you, friends. Namaste.